what's going on? Welcome to the course on iOS development. I wanted to start this course off with a bit of an intro of myself and of what you're going to be learning and also demo a application that I have made that is in app review pending release in the app store. So my name is Afraz. I am a Microsoft engineer. I've been working on iOS for almost 10 years now, which is mind blowing to think about. I've built applications for the iPhone, iPad, Apple Watch, tvOS. Uh, cumulatively, I have apps that have 30 million plus downloads on the store. Uh, I, like I mentioned, work full time on this as well as on the side. Uh, in this course, you're going to be learning from an absolute beginner standpoint how to plan out an application, the fundamentals of Swift, designing user interfaces, testing, running the application, uh, and honestly, everything in between. Uh, I've divided it up into several sections with bite size and digestible course lengths. Uh, each video is meant to be no more than 10 to 15 minutes at the absolute max. So you can go back and bookmark places of where you left off. In addition to that, it's just easier to follow along uh, in my own personal experience and from the feedback that I've gotten for the prior videos that I've done. So with that being said, I wanted to go over a couple uh, housekeeping rules about this course and get your opinions on it. So first and foremost, uh, we're going to be using this format of screen recording here. Um, I've set it up so when I zoom in, it'll zoom in the screen as well for you guys. And I've done that because I found in the past that when someone's typing or they say click on a particular button in a particular area, uh, oftentimes, people find themselves pausing the video and trying to find where said person clicked. So I think zooming in will help us uh, really hone in on what part of the screen button um, in Xcode, the editor that we will be using, what button I'm clicking, where it is. So let me know in the comments uh, on this video and also every following video uh, if you like the format, if you dislike it, uh, in general, just thoughts. Uh, with that being said, uh, let's jump into this application that I have here. Um, by the end of the course, you'll be able to build uh, this exact application or something even much better and cooler. So this application here basically shows you popular YouTube videos, uh, integrating the Google SDK and frameworks to go to YouTube and basically get videos. We can of course click on a video and it'll play the video if it's public. And down here we can rate the video. Um, we can add it to our favorites, see related videos. And once we go back here, you can see that we can even search for a video. So let's say I want to find funny cat videos, like we all want to find. We can search, it's pretty fast. Um, this application is using a variety of UI components, a variety of Swift programming interfaces. So I'm really excited to get this course started for you all. Um, hopefully, as this course goes on, I'd like to improve things with your guys' feedback. So I really want people to be engaged, um, and I really want to jump right into the practical stuff. I will definitely be covering fundamentals, but I'm a big believer in learning by doing. So we're going to really do some hands-on uh, work and design actual things that can go to the App Store. And of course, we're going to go over things like in-app purchases as well and how to monetize and really generate revenue off of all the hard work you're going to invest in this. So with that being said, um, I am looking forward to seeing you in the course and stay tuned. Uh, definitely hit that like button, subscribe and turn on uh, notifications to get every single video update once the new video is uh, available for you guys' viewing. See you in the course.